All right, purple people eater, head on down behind me. He's got a purple truck. Don't really know why, but a purple F-150. Garrett, you are my partner in crime, my compadre, my whatever. Uh, we're going <laughs> to head down to our field. I'm going to show you while I'm showing the viewers. Garrett hasn't seen it. Let me explain everything when we get to our location. You have not. I have not seen it at all. I, I, we, we spend a lot of money to get it, but I have not seen it. All right, so... Let me kind of, I'm going to pull up to where our farm is actually going to be. It's not going to be over here. It's going to be over here. Okay, so this is, yeah, let me explain when I get there. So I'm driving the F-350. This is going to be my new farm truck. This is a whole new map, a whole new server. I actually forgot what the map is called. We will not be on Rolling Hills, and I will explain that in a jiffy. All right, let's go ahead. Uh, nothing right happened. Here. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. No, we didn't hit. That was close, though. Nope. Nope. All right, so. Let me open up my map. I have a bit of explaining to do why we're here, what we're doing. So this map is called Garrett, do you know? So after a bit of research, this is Honeydew Farms XL. So huge shout out to the creator of this. And uh, yeah, it seems so far to be a really, really nice open, open map. So what this is, is this is Master Farmer's farming tournament that he's starting on New Year's Day. So we are purple team. We are gonna be farm four. Right here, I, like I guess. The color. <laughs> yeah, purple. It's Garrett's color. So, we actually went ahead and purchased Field Eight, which is humongous. It is like takes up the whole entire corner of the map, and then obviously we had to buy this part as well to actually like make our farm. So that is what we're doing. And you're probably wondering, like, Spencer TV, you just started like kind of your own farming tournament, and I did, I did. It crashed. It like doesn't work it, anymore. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty much gone. Me and Garrett were trying to get it in, in it to record a video just yesterday, and boom, it was gone. Very disappointing. And then I knew that Master had this bad boy up and was just about to start the tournament. And there was like a day left for us to make our farm. So this episode is me and Garrett making our farm. Lots of live streams, lots of videos coming out on this farming tournament. Very exciting. And uh, yeah, we are owning all field eight. And then for case fans. This should be a very happy episode for you because we are going all red, all case IH, baby. <laughs> Garrett, what do you like think about it, that? I like it. I, I like it. I, I don't drive case often. I'm usually a John Deere guy, but case is really good. I'll be honest. If they're, they're pretty good, you brand. need to find a purple tractor. That's what you need to do. Yeah, find yourself I, a purple guys, tractor. Somebody needs to make us a purple tractor mod pack. No, they do not. With every tractor having a purple. <laughs> That'd be terrible. Imagine you come to the farm one day, it's just completely purple. All right, Garrett. So the move is, let's head out over here because this corner is kind of where we're going to dedicate our farm to. And, and we're going to have a pretty big farm. I want to I want to expand it a lot. It's going to be pigs and horses, and we can always expand it in the future. We aren't the most creative mind. So <laughs> go in the comment section. Let us know what else we can do. A lot of today is pretty much the whole entire time. I do want to get the combines in the field. Garrett, we're going to have plenty of oats. The whole entire field yeah. A is out, dude. I, remind me, the F-150, I think it needs to go for some work for its brakes. Uh, I clicked the brakes, and I think I may have slid, you, I don't know, you hit the, uh, five, 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 six meters, seven meters. It, oh. was, it was a bit crazy. I All didn't right. hit anything, though. Good, good. So, uh, I don't think for, for grass, we should have this. We're going to pretty much just mow this grass field, whatever. Oh. It doesn't become the farm. So... First, I just want to, I'm pretty much just going to drop concrete down everywhere. Okay. And then okay, if, watch, <clears throat> like we do have a lot of money right now to our, do our initial startup, but let's still be mindful of that. Yeah. But you know, we can always add money into. Yeah. Yeah. Guys. So the way it's working for the beginning, we can have as much money as we need to start off. Uh, there, well, there is restrictions. You can only have up to like four tractors and different things like that. Right. Um, mm -hmm. but you pretty much can have as much money as you need because they know not everything, like every brand costs the same and things like that. Uh, so that's why they kind of did it like that. And if you guys are wondering like what happened to our farm server, like why did it go like wrong? I actually have no idea. So this this thing, the same thing happened to squad as well. And he didn't really, it just said the game was paused and it didn't let you do stuff. So that is all I know. And then also on our farm, we're going to be having Artist Jack coming in and helping us. So that's just a heads up yes. as well. And uh, yeah, that is what we got to do. So yeah, pretty much just start making this concrete pad. And then mm -hmm. we will uh, we'll kind of start placing it down. Obviously, farmhouse silos. 
Uh, we're going to have all red barns. Very exciting. And go in the comment section. We are not done customizing. We'll probably never be done customizing, even at the end of the video, yeah. just because that's us and we, we always want to improve things. So go in the comment section. Let us know what else we can do to the farm. I guess once you see it at the end of the video, obviously we don't <laughs> have a farm right now. We're just putting down. So they're going to have to watch till the end. That's what that means. Or skip to the end if they don't no, have the no, patience. No, no, no. You guys can watch till the end. That's fine. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it, yeah, it's whatever. Just let me know what you guys want to see improved. For the case fans, you're welcome. I'm going all case. I don't want to say I'm sick and tired of John Deere, but I want to switch it up in our We've done John Deere a lot, guys. John yeah. Deere is amazing, but me and Spencer are talking. We, we've, we've done a lot of John Deere. And I want to keep guys. everything... Um, this the same i i, I want to keep a brand on the farm i want to be loyal yeah. to a certain brand here on the farm so there we go here's kind of our concrete pad so far i think it's plenty big it's oh it, yeah it's plenty it big. Looks, so, how much would this cost in your life to do um millions of uh, just the concrete pad would probably be probably really like a hundred thousand dollars oh that is i mean if you, here let me jump out like guys this is huge this, this would be yeah this is like ginormous. Look at the size of our vehicles. And I know like a vehicle-wide, like quarter of a mile driveway is like forty thousand dollars. I think I oh. I, I don't want to say exactly. So we're gonna go all red and um. So first, here's our first shed. I actually don't know what. Okay, there's the front. Actually, uh, let's place Ooh, down I, our house. We should. I'm I'm <laughs> always nervous about placing things down, but once I get going, we should be good. So let's place down yeah. our house. Obviously, first here, and then. I'll get it out of the way. I'll just stand in a field. By the way, when you're done with that, look at the sun. It's just the view with it's so like majestic. I don't know. I just love looking like over kind of don't look like right at the sun, but there's a cool like haze over the world. I like it. Yeah, it's it's morning time. I see what you're saying. It's kind of like a little foggy. It is yeah. uh, it is morning time. Okay, I have no idea where to place, but I'm gonna place it. This is it my down. favorite time in game by far, like of the day. I, lo I just love how everything looks at this time. All right, did I place this in the right spot? Uh, if place it in a spot, it it works. Is it backwards or is it is this um, the back side? Well, you enter the side, right? Oh. Yeah, so like that's right where you're entering, the side where you just were at. And then that's is the this back. the front of the house or is this no, the that's the back and then the doors at the front, so right there is the door. I'm gonna sell it and reflip it around then. Okay. Okay, hopefully it didn't change the ground height. Uh, no, looks pretty, maybe a bit, but... Maybe just a hair, but no, no worries at all. All right, let's get this bad boy here, and then... Okay, so there's the garage, and I'm going to back it up to the field, actually. I like doing that a little better. There we go. Much better. And obviously, we can smooth this out. It created a little divot, but that's going to that's gonna happen naturally. All right, let's go to... All right, now let's get down to business. And also, we have other... We can place down Garrett, if you want to go in decorations and then kind of kind of make yeah. the make the house a little better there's other like um other like house like a small garage small shed okay what am i doing now oh yeah i gotta go to sheds i'm all just right. flattening out this land a bit right now oh yeah gotcha gotcha all right so here's where we're, we're gonna start our machinery sheds and uh kind of pretty far away from the house obviously and we are going to need uh, horse paddocks and everything, so I feel like we're going to run out of space, but I'm trying to be somewhat conservative. Ooh, what's this farm farm storage shelter? This is built in game? I've never seen farm this before. Storage. Go to decorations. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that came with, uh, probably came with this, this map, this map. I you know how it. each one has different Yeah, map. yeah, yeah. That's really cool. Yeah, it is. I really like how that looks. Good All job, right. whoever created that. <laughs> so next thing, I'm going to place this one right here, kind of in the could corner. plant trees. That could be something we do, plant trees around here. Garrett, no tree just, planting around just, these parts. Just, just an idea, just an idea. In the future, we could theoretically do that. Maybe you can lower stuff down too if, if you don't want the big inclines created. Yeah, oh, I guess yeah, the ground's not leveled mean. though. The ground's not really level at all, so it's kind of hard to do. But you can always lower them a little bit. Okay. All right, just place down a big red shed. Oh my yeah, goodness, that thing is huge. There it is. Yeah. 
That's okay, so, okay. It's, a, it's a pretty good spot because these two sheds are like kind of facing each other and this has a side door and everything so i really like uh kind of where i place this let's open up these doors real quick okay i'm gonna place down one of those big like kind of just covers over top like a shed kind of but more open <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. See, uh, maybe, exactly. uh, maybe place one of these next to next to the red shit over here. Um, yeah. To the right of it, just yeah, yeah an yeah. open one, and then we'll yeah. we'll be good on storage for sure. Okay, so here, let me get a good height. Uh, I think that's probably where. Which one are you buying? The smallest one? I would... the, not the smallest. Okay. Does it have yep. panels? Uh, no. Okay. So do we get one with panels? Uh, no, it's uh, no. I, I kind of like the open one because then we won't have the issue. Like we have two enclosed sheds already, mm -hmm. right? Very true. Very true. Open one. Open big one. Yeah, go yeah. open one. Okay, <laughs> there we go. And then we're gonna have our shop here, so we can customize things. Let me place it down real quick. Um, yeah, the ground is definitely not level around here, but it's not too bad. It's, and it's, it's very, usable. it's very easily fixable. All right, I'm gonna get yes. the large grain silo as well here, okay. so we can pull up. I'm gonna open up our big barn doors. Oh my god, those things are ginormous. <laughs> yeah, no, they're pretty Holy big. Holy cow! But think about it. Um, I guess we don't have. We'll have a lot of implements. Oh. We, we can have uh, we can have two combines, but then four tractors, not counting the combines. So yeah, just the heads yeah, up so there gonna, for the viewers. Need to, need to figure that out. I, we might even guys, we might save like we might buy like three tractors and then save the fourth one uh, for artists to buy, since obviously he will be joining us. We want we want him to be able to choose his trusty steed. Uh, I guess his, he can get his truck too. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, I'm gonna place it on the hayloft. Don't really know where it's supposed to be. Um, Ooh, yeah. Um, just kind of make it look good. If it fits, I'm in, gonna place it by the house actually, because yeah. it kind of matches the texture. Yeah, that's exactly where I was thinking. Perfect. Okay, we right, could even change the pens. Here. I'm gonna get a horse paddock. We're gonna okay. get the smaller of the ones, just because I know we don't need the big one. Should that's I just get something. A big that, one? Uh, yeah, get a pig enclosure. We probably won't buy pigs right off the bat. Small pig enclos enclosure? Oh. Um, uh, it holds 100, and the big one holds 300. Think that there is a lot of stuff we need to feed them. <laughs> yeah, do, uh, do small for now. Yeah, and it's cheaper each day. There is an upkeep, obviously. Okay, I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna place the horse paddock kind of not where we have our concrete. Oh, okay. You know, yeah, I'll place um, the pig one but the but the pig confinement, it. keep it in. Oh, maybe do maybe do left of the silo. Left, left of, of the, the silo. Yeah, I'm gonna place it on the horse paddock real quick. Right, oh, so see, like it, it, okay, I was facing a different direction. Yeah, so this thing see, in between the shed and the silo. Between the shed and the silo. No, um, to oh. in, make it okay, okay. with the horse paddock in the silo. Okay, if that makes sense. All right, I need to do some leveling after that gets placed down. We're going to start a quick little time lapse here, finish up some kinks uh, that are kind of going on at the farm. Again, comment section, do your work. I do. I am going to probably live stream this here in a few days, so so stay tuned for that. Garrett, you, all right, there it is. Oh, a there little too go. close. Um, yeah, it was being difficult to place down. Kind of snapped last we second. We should be fine, and we can kind of work yeah. that out, but just yeah, a we can hair level it, too close. Level it. Um, but it should be fine. And then also we're gonna we're gonna make roads to to the roadway. We are going to do a lot of uh, kind of ground modification, like making paths and stuff. And we, we'll have like grass around the house, obviously, because we don't want a concrete <laughs> house. So yeah, just you don't a want a few. concrete house? I do not. I do not. So <laughs> let's start that. Hopefully this time lapse is cool. Should be very cool. And I will see you guys in a jiffy. Check the tag, decision is made, lock your
Alright guys, so the farm is kind of set. We do kind of have an open area. So if you guys have any other ideas, I guess this is kind of just room for growth. We can take this out and I'm thinking that we might repaint it to grass or dirt or something. But uh, I placed it on the house. We have a garage. We have the hayloft. And then we have a lime station, herbicide station, seed, and liquid fertilizer station. So is there anything else? It's awesome that they put these mods in here. Um, <clears throat> there is a solid fertilizer station which we should put down as well not really sure where yes. we should put it um uh really anywhere we have again we have lots of space we, we actually we have lots of space i wanted to keep it everywhere. back here i just didn't want maybe mm -hmm. i could have placed like all four lining up i actually could do that do you let's actually we should do that can you go ahead and sell all four of those they're kind of tucked away okay and then i think what we're gonna do is line them up i actually don't know which way they unload which is kind of a problem and I then we do have a fuel tank as well which is is amazing i love how they have that in the so this is master farmers farming tournament his farming tournament and there are a lot of people in here i think there's four farms now and each farm has like like three or two people there's police officers too yeah i think there's some even with like four or five people so really yeah yeah oh, yeah i'm pretty sure there is Dang. All right. Well, I'm going right, to so place down these right now. Yeah. Perfect. There's lime herbicide is coming up next. And I think ah, this is going to look sweet. really good. Oh, yeah. And it's good because it's kind of like in the entrance from where the shop is almost. So if we buy something from the shop, we can quickly go over and fill it. And it's also close to the fields. So, so it's a good location. Wee oui, wee. Oui. There we are. We got five. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, yeah. Dude. Here, let's place down. You, you were mentioning the shop. I know we need to place that down. So here, uh, is it decoration? No. Sheds. So this is the, this is a shop. Um, where can I place it down? Can you move the trucks real yeah. quick? I was yeah. thinking that that would be a good spot. Let's get these things moved. Here, I'll just put them. Which eh. side is the that entrance? Works. Not really sure. We own this land, yes. Okay, this object's yeah. colliding with an object. No worries. And then, yeah, yeah you could that. just go park them at the house. Oh, uh, yeah. Park them at the yeah, house. That. Okay, I'll let you place those down. And I'll drive these over. There we there go. We Looks go. good. So that's where we can customize our shop. I didn't, yes, I put it in a perfect spot. There we go. Okay, so here's the farm. Most of the sheds, I guess both sheds are red, so that's super cool. And now it's time, your favorite time, to grab all the equipment. We're going to have two identical harvesters, two case axle flow, 90... Okay, do, why do I still have those lines? All right, cool. Or we could go... Yeah, we're just going to have... We're, gonna, we're just going to have identical um, combines because, you know, we're case. That's what we <laughs> do here. And then, Garrett, if you want to grab the quad track, that's going to be our biggest tractor, case quad track. Oh, we're going we're gonna to get one of those? Yeah, upgrade that sucker to the... To the Hey, to you the can. max <laughs> to the max okay. yes oh yeah just putting these trucks away right now we have two different uh plate like garages at our house one connected and one's a bit further away so it's perfect yeah yeah it's super nice all right there we go i'm gonna place or uh, excuse me i'm gonna buy these do, do, do. okay this is cheap i'm gonna buy two of them <laughs> one okay. and two so buy a quad track you're saying we oui, we oui, please do that okay by upgrade as much as you can. Is there a case header? Uh, where is the quad track? Uh -huh. It's in large tractors. Oh, uh, okay. This modded ones after it. Okay, quad tracks here. So there we go. There we go. Okay, so we um, big... just got a corn header. What's up, Garrett? There's even big buds and stuff. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah there are big buds, but we're just gonna not go for all us. red. Not for not us. Not for us. <laughs> Correct. There we go. Okay. 
All right, I'm just gonna tab over real quick, see what the move is. Ooh. Did that header come with the trailer? It did. Okay, that was super nice that it came with the. Oh, came with I like. The... Yeah, the big headers seem to, like, yeah. there's two headers that have trailers built in. Which yeah, is really... built in. So you just fold it up, which is I love it. It's so nice. And then yeah, if you just we don't need a trailer for the corn mm -hmm. header because it folds up. And then let's start. I'm gonna buy. So we have three other tractors because uh, we have four total and we just bought the k squad mm -hmm. track all right yeah. then we're so the k squad track is going to be our biggest tractor by far and then going yeah. down the mm -hmm. line we're going to get for our second biggest tractor it's going to be the magnum series Ooh. okay okay we'll bump that up crawler tracks no yeah i think not. i'm going to put twin wheels on it so it can okay. pull a lot. You can put rear twins, and you can put a rear track, crawl track, but I no. <laughs> I don't like it. It does not look good. I'm going to go doubles on this boy. All right, there we go. We got twins yeah. on her. Imagine getting tracks on the back. Oh, that would be so... I, I, so guys, I'm not hating if you have it, but I... It doesn't seem look that good, for it. in my yeah. opinion. Um, it doesn't look good, and why? Like, that's not the kind of tractor you really want with tracks at the back yeah it i mean obviously some people want it but i just yeah. didn't like the look okay so we have wide uh wide tires with weights wheel weights one okay. two should we get a weight too just so we have it um just in case we need it like who knows right yeah, it, you might as well yeah. buy one uh and then we can just hook up with it yeah and then we are going to medium tractors and we're gonna get the puma baby where's she at there it is, the Puma series. This is what we're gonna have for a front loader, Garrett. Wheel okay. weights, we should probably have those on. We have and no then... case weights, no. <laughs> oh, we can change the color, okay. I guess red? Red yes. or white? Red, uh, yeah. red, red. Come on, Garrett. Okay. Yes, well, all right. They both would work. <laughs> That's true, that's true. All right, so we got the case there. We need to get front loader. So a lot of buying is going to be going on here today. And at the end of this, I hope the farm is beautiful. It should be. Um, I always forget which one did I get. What front loader was the correct size? Case I age. Ooh. Buy. See if that front loader fits the Puma. I'll okay. test it out real quick. Oh, you will? I okay. got. Sounds good. Sounds good. And then, okay, yeah, so we should get a grain trailer too. Yeah, yeah. Uh, look for semis. Not sure what um, what semis we have in what here. What type of? Yeah, I have no idea what type of semis we have in. Uh, here. we have a Kenworth and a Peterbilt. So a 1974 Kenworth. Go, uh, yeah, yeah. Go Peterbilt. Peterbilt because everybody voted for Peterbilt when we did that poll, and I want to keep things very similar here. Um, we're having the pretty much the same object objectives, but different tractors. And so, uh, yeah. All right, Sounds good. For that, we'll get the I'll bucket making, on here. I'll try making it the kind of case colors. See what we can do. Yeah, you should be able to get... Um, yeah, red with white highlights. Yeah, you should be... Good. Either get red or white. Sometimes we might have too much red. It might be a yeah. little weird, but... Uh, so white with... Well, white with red highlights looks terrible. It does. So. Um... Maybe just go all white. All white? Ooh, okay. Try all white. Get a well, green. Like off white, kind of. Yeah, that might be good. Ooh, yeah, it's, it's kind of like a creamy white. I kind of like that. And then, here, let me see how the red accents look. All right, I'm getting the biggest grain uh, trailer in the world. Grain cart, excuse me. Um. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to get the biggest one. The Hall Master Boys. This thing is a beast we should probably or i'm just going to ah uh, it's probably it's probably too much i'm thinking i don't know if we should get the hall master we do have a humongous field but guys really let's let's stay realistic we really don't need it in my yeah. opinion and then i think we'll get two kenzies um just because we'll be running two tractors at a time or two combines all right um Okay, the truck is bought. I like the inside. Ooh, I think this is brought over from last game because I, I, I recognize this interior, which is, again, an amazing interior. So I'm happy it was brought over. <laughs> there we go. 
All right, boys, our equipment is coming Ooh. together very good. And uh, now it's kind of, kind of, I'm moving over to implement, implements and uh, what, we'll have one cultivator. Are we gonna need crop protection too? Gotta think about that. Yes, yes, we will. We're gonna go ahead and get, the, get my favorite sprayer of all time. We might need the biggest sprayer, but I'm gonna just stick with the sprayer that we've had. I know we have a big field, but do the, I'll buy, I'll buy it right now. The green and orange one. The green and orange one, I don't, the, <laughs> the star, star, I guess the it's colors the, could be a bit better on that. I, I'm not a, the biggest fan of the colors on it. Yeah, it's kind of a um, unique looking yeah. one. Um, right, Let's go yeah. cedars here. So should we get a big grain trailer? Um, a big great yes. You need a you yeah, need a semi. You need a semi okay. trailer. There yep. is ooh. There's a modded one that is uh, like two of them together, like an extra long one. That's kind of cool. Never driven one of those. Okay, we okay. are out of space here, so we need to start driving things down and yeah. uh, kind of getting that out of the way. Okay, so let's start attaching stuff up. Yeah, let's start with the combines maybe or. Yeah. Yeah, you, quite go for the, you go for the head, the corn header, and I'll go for the, the header trailer. All right, so let me know what you guys think of the farm so far. Again, we have field eight. We have one field. Obviously, we're going to separate it off. We won't plant one, uh, one crop at all. Like, for the whole entire field, we can separate it and make it look real nice. Should and, I put a trailer on here or just drive this down now? Uh, just, just drive it down, drive it down. We'll get right, it going go first, here. ladies first. There you ladies go. Ladies first. Thank you, thank you. And the really nice thing is, we do need to build a uh, official road to our farm. One that so we can go left here, mm -hmm. and then uh, yeah, um, I should probably do that like right now. But yeah, that is the move, guys. I will. I'll probably cut to when we have all of our equipment over here and we have things kind of wrapping up. All right, guys. So we pretty much drove everything down. Lots, lots more to actually do. A few, a few things that we need to fix. We do need to make a road to, uh, to like the main roads and stuff. But that's just we'll we'll do that in streams. I want to stream this um, throughout the week this week. So be stay tuned for that. And uh, yeah, the farm tournament is officially starting on New Year's. So it's gonna get competitive. Our money will go back down, and things will start getting. Uh, Start getting even and very competitive. So hope you guys did enjoy today's episode. If you're a case fan, that's awesome because we got all case. Thank you all so much for watching. Peace out, and I'll see you all in the next one.